Hey, this your Happy Hood Stutter. As promised, I have arrived to the uh, food bank pickup location. And so I uh, called, I placed my order ahead, and I was able to choose the items that they had available, which you can choose up to, I think, 35 items or 40 items. Um, most of the items, maximum amount is two. And some things are one. Like, for instance, they have beef stew, a large... Um, um, serving a beef stew and you can only get one of those um, things like raisins and uh, applesauce um, a six pack cup of applesauce you can get like two of those um, pork chops you can get two um, most canned goods two um, canned salmon two so I'll be sure to show you the things that um, I get when I when I when they bring it so all you have to do is just pull up to a parking space once you pull up to a parking space and um, you just pop your trunk open and they'll come out and bring your items. So that's how it looks. So you have somebody come out and bring the items to you and it looks like my stuff is being loaded up as we speak. How you doing? Okay. So hold on. Yes. Uh -huh. I thought I had to give the number. My items are loaded up, so he put them in, and so, yep, here we go. I know I ordered two bags of peaches. That was a maximum of two broccoli and things, fresh broccoli. So, all the goodies, all the goodies. Oh, blocks of cheese. Y'all, look at that. Blocks, blocks of mild cheddar cheese. So, let's get home. Let me get back, and um, I'll be sure to unload this stuff, and... On my trip home, I'm going to just be sightseeing and I'll pull everything out and show you what it is that I got. And hopefully you can utilize the food pantries in your area, wherever you live. And remember, at the end of this video, if you look in my description, I'm going to share a website that will put you in touch with uh, resources in your community, no matter where you are in the United States. So stay tuned. Okay, y'all. I made it back and I got my son unloading the goods. So I'm going to turn it over. I'm going to organize everything and let you all see. All right. So once you move that box and when he moves that box, I'm going to go ahead and, you know, just spread everything out. See uh, what's all in the boxes. Those were the two boxes that you saw in the back seat. And then um, we'll go over all of these goodies. Stay tuned. Okay, y'all, we got all the food out. So, okay. So, this was a total of 49 pounds um, worth of food. There were other things that I could have checked off and gotten, but, you know, we don't eat it, so I didn't get it. And, um, you know, I know they say get things for other people and stuff like that. I give information and resources. Like, I can't do your work because if I do your work, then you'll depend on me to feed you. You'll depend on me to water you, all that, and I'll clip you, clip your leaves, your in, prune you, and baby, look, I even offer rides and stuff like that. Like I say, people don't get on a bandwagon. They kind of want you to do things for them. Um, I do have, like, um, things, kits that I made for people. They're not put together, but I got the empty little Dollar Tree um you know, uh, what you call them shoe tubs that I can utilize to help somebody in need. So, you know, um, but of course I will be assessing that on, um, case by case situation because like I said, I done had people, I done offer rides and all that kind of stuff. Everybody pride in the way, baby. Guess what? Okay. So let me show y'all what we got. So this category is our dry fruits. We have California raisins. That's two bags. And it's, uh, let me see. I think it's a pound. Oh, 15 ounces. Well, close to a pound. Dried cranberries. You know, you can get you some chocolate and some um, nuts and stuff like that. And they do give us walnuts and, and stuff like that in big bags. And we can use that to make like a trail mix and stuff. And pretzels, you know. I got these pretzels um, from Dollar Tree. I can make like a trail mix bag and put it in the kids' lunch and just have it for snack. We have two boxes of Kraft macaroni and cheese. We got a block, a pound of the, um, no, two pounds of the um, Wisconsin Premium Natural Mild Cheddar Cheese. 
Um, also, two boxes of Food Life Balance Jambalaya. And it includes uh, it's Creole style chicken and brown rice with tomatoes and roasted pepper. So, all of that is included. So, I guess it's dried. Um, these are pork chops. So, this is the meat. I couldn't put this over there with that because I didn't want it to get, you know, get the table wet, but it's frozen. But these are USDA um, pork loins. And we got two packs of these. White premium chicken. I got a lot of that because every time I go, we get that. Um, this is beef stew ready to eat. So ready to eat meals are always good. So let me see the date on this. See how long this is um, good for. Just to give you an idea, you know, um, this is best if used by September 2027. So you keep getting these and you'll have food for long term. So you want to kind of eat your food that, um, you know, you want to eat the food that is... Uh, the dates are closer and maybe the uh, other food, uh, long-term food, you want to kind of save that for long-term. So um, we have pistachios. So we get plenty of these. We get a pound. So I got two pounds of those. Like I say, limit on most things is two. Sweet corn, black beans, two pounds of spaghetti, cut green beans, pinto beans, Concord grape juice, which is so delicious, and this apple juice. So... There you have it. And like I say, in my um, description, I'm going to leave a website in the description. So no matter where you are, you can identify your food bank, multiple food banks, according to the zip code or the zip code that you're going to be in or a move in. And please share this information with your families um, because a lot of people simply don't know or not aware of how they are able to, you know, have access to uh, free food. And um, a lot of this is not income based. It's just that if you say yet you you're in need and there's times that you know you're in between meals or may struggle or something like that, then you know feel free to go and grab you know some some food for you and your family. So that way you you can you know have something for a rainy day. So we got to put the way for the rainy day. And in fact, it is raining here in the Great Washington D.C. Casablanca. And until next time, grab that link be uh, that website below. Share it with your family members. Utilize it yourself. It is all type of social services resources on that website. Um, to to any category that you wish. Please, 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 by all means, get started. It is never too late. People always say, oh, it's too late. You just start, look, get started. Um, until next time, take care. Bye-bye.